In this video, we are going to find all prime numbers a and b, such that a to the power b plus b to the power a is a prime number. Before we move on, don't forget to give a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on post notifications. When we are given that a to the power b plus b to the power a is a prime number, it might be helpful if we consider whether this prime number is even or odd. Of course, we know that if this prime number is even, then it can only be 2. But this is actually impossible because as we have the fact that a and b are both prime numbers, so that means a and b are at least 2. So that means the sum of the two powers is at least 2 squared plus 2 squared, and that's 8. So that means if this number is at least 8, and it's a prime number, this number must be odd. And odd prime. And the reason that finding, uh, deciding whether it's odd or even is helpful, because in nature, this expression is sum of two terms. When sum of two terms is even, then we can say that both terms have the same parity, which means they are either both odd or both even. But now it's an odd prime, in particular, an odd number. So that means one of them must be an even number, and then the other number has to be odd, so that the sum is an odd number. Now, this is useful because we know that for prime numbers, given that it's a prime number, a and B are very likely to be odd because prime numbers are either um, odd or uh, exactly 2. The only even prime is 2. 2 is the only even prime number. And we were told that one of the powers is odd. So let's, let me write it here. Then either, or I should not say either one, but exactly one of them then I can further assume that by symmetry the power of a is odd. Well, I should not say odd, but I should actually emphasize the fact that it's even. It means the same thing, but the context is different. So let's assume that a to the power b is even. Now, the only possibility for that to happen is that a is also even. But this means a is an even number and also a prime number, so that means we know that a equals 2. So we can rephrase the question and say find odd prime b. We know that now a to the b is even, so b to the a is odd, so b is odd. Find odd prime p, b, sorry such that 2 to the b plus b squared is prime. So now we have rephrased the question to this. Now before moving on, maybe we can try some values of b and see whether uh, we can observe any pattern. So say when b is 3, 2 to the b plus b squared equals 2 cubed plus 3 squared equals 17, which is a prime. When b is 5, then 2 to the b plus b squared is 2 power 5 plus 5 squared. And that's 57, and that's 3 times 19, so not a prime. If b is 7, 
then this expression is 2 to the 7 plus 7 squared 128 plus 49 is 177 and that's 3 times 59 again not a prime we're going to try a few more given that we can memorize the powers uh, two of I mean two to the power of that number of that prime number two o four eight plus um, eleven squared is one two one so that's two one six nine and that's three times seven hundred and twenty three so again not prime now at this point you might have observed the pattern already. For 2 to the power of 13 plus 13 squared is 8192 plus 169, so that's 8361, and that's 3 times 2787. I'm not sure whether you have the same thing um, as I do in your mind, but when b is a prime that is not equal to 3, this expression will always take a value that is a multiple of 3. So maybe, maybe we can try to prove that this expression is, most, is for most of the time a multiple of 3. So let's see how things go. Now for in general, I should say the idea is consider more three in general, two to the power b is congruent to minus one to the power b mod three, and because b is odd, so that's congruent to minus one mod three. Let's make a remark here: is because b odd, and for b squared, is congruent to zero or one mod three. And we only have b to be congruent to 0 mod 3 when only when b equals to 3 because b is also a prime. So it can't always be multiple of 3. It can only uh, take that a remainder when b is exactly equal to 3. Now that means when b prime and b is larger than 3 2 to the power b plus b squared must be congruent to minus 1 plus 1 mod 3 and that's 0 mod 3 so that means it's a multiple of 3 and of course it's larger than 3 so therefore this expression is not prime when B is larger than 3. Therefore, B can only be 3 and at this time it will be 17, a prime. So our only solutions can only be either 2, 3 or of course by symmetry we can swap like because we assume at the beginning that a is the even number so if we assume otherwise that b is the even number then we, we would have solved that b is equal to 2 and a is equal to 3 so these two are the only solutions and this is our final answer